Good morning, friends. This video is meant for every one of us, and I'm going to explore that we, we need to find purpose and meaning in life. Friends, it is very important to understand what purpose do we have in life. Without purpose, our life will not be as meaningful as we wish to have. Purpose is the core of life. Everybody must have some purpose in life. Whether he is a student or whether he is a businessman, whether he is an entrepreneur, every one of us must have a purpose in life. It is the purpose of life that really motivates and inspires us to do the things in the right direction. Purpose may be defined as a, as a name or a goal or a destination for someone. For students, it may be the purpose of achieving the right academic qualification. For a good businessman, the purpose is to increase his uh, productivity and sell of products and to improve his company. For every human being, there must be a binding purpose which really makes that person understand the meaning of life. And to understand more conceptually, the aim of life is to live it to the fullest and to enjoy every moment of it. There are many people actually, they believe that when they are engaged in their work, they, they certainly will be happy. And that is really true. The more you are involved in your work, the more you are engrossed in your work, the more you are participated in your organization, the more you are <coughs> involved and concerned about your work, the more meaningful will be your life. So <clears throat> we should live life keeping in view the real goal of life is to do what really makes us or what really matters for us. If doing our work every day matters for us, it is the purpose of life. If excelling in our you know, job and career makes us happy, we should find it our purpose. If reaching a mountain for a mountainer is the purpose of life, he should try climbing. If cracking a competitive jam makes a student happy, he should always go for that. If breaking the records of all, I mean, scores in cricket is the purpose of a cricketer, he should go for it. So the purpose of life is definitely a motivating force. It is a force behind which we employ our energy and we create a sense of, you know, meaning for that. So the moment we decide our aim and purpose of life, the moment we decide the goal of our life, we start endeavoring on and we start trying to achieve it, try to explore it, try to broaden it and try to ultimately make, make, make it meaningful in life. There is an example a person who didn't succeed to achieve his desired goal. He went on thinking what he should do. He lost his capital. He couldn't succeed in his business, but he didn't give up. He just thought that he should try once more. The second time he invested a small amount and he succeeded. He grew his capital and the third time he invested with a huge amount. The fourth time he be became a millionaire. So what I want to suggest that it is not necessary that your first failure is ruining your purpose. No, your first failure is just a lesson. Keep it a, as a lesson and work out on your fallacies, or your demerits and try to revamp, re try to uh, formulate and formulate the changes that can really make you successful. So keep working on your plan and go meaningfully to achieve the target. If you are not having a right purpose in life, your target will never be fulfilled. So define your goal very specifically that what you want to achieve or what really makes you happy or what really matters for you. And once you decide what really matters for you, the goal of life, the purpose of life will be clear. And then you will work, you will keep your endeavor in the right direction. You will stride in the right direction with the right effort 
and you will certainly reach the goal of life. And then that will make you a meaningful purpose of living a beautiful life. Because life is just once, it is not twice. You, you have got the chance to live it to the fullest and to the best of your ability just once. Nobody knows the second life. Everybody knows that it is first and the last life. So we should try to do the best to make it meaningful and purposeful. And that is what I wanted to emphasize upon. This is Edison on the channel, Easy English by Edison. Thank you. Have a nice day.